We're on set again with Ryan Connor. Yes. Why do you think it's taken us almost a year to get you back? Um, I have no idea. Yeah, I, I'm I not. I blame you entirely. I'm not. In, I'm not in charge of booking. <laughs> I blame you. <laughs> so when you got in in '99, how was the landscape differently, other than Ooh. the technology? Holy mackerel! People were making money left and right, so they were a lot more chill. Mm -hmm. um, we had craft services, which means you come to set, you mm -hmm. don't have to worry about bringing food. Mm -hmm. um, you were usually in and out in three hours. Wow. At most, like maybe four, unless you were doing some big budget film. Mm -hmm. There were only a few companies that did those kind of things. It was mm -hmm. a lot of gonzo. Mm -hmm. um, uh, just, and the vibe of people was, it, I remember feeling like pe it was the people really liked sex, you mm -hmm. know, even the women really liked, really enjoyed what they were mm -hmm. doing. Um, sex, drugs, and rock and roll stands true, but <laughs> there were still a, a good portion of people that just, you know, they're horny people. They like right. doing what they do. Right. And now it seems a little bit more political, mm -hmm. oddly. Um, you know. People are not making the money. In fact, there's so much theft going on. Everybody is concerned about that. It's always on people's minds. They're always trying to get the maximum amount of content possible in mm -hmm. one scene. So that means you're going to be on set. I mean, I've been on, you know, sets where I've been there for nine hours. That's ridiculous. Yeah. And and it's not even like a big budget setup. So mm -hmm. it's like, why am I here for nine hours? <laughs> <laughs> and most of that time you're just waiting around, is, is, is that right? Um, no, I think the better you are at doing stills and posing, the more they take. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's true. And I have found, like, oh my god, a ridiculous amount of pictures, mm -hmm. and thousands. Right. Like, not just... <laughs> there's no reason. If you're a good photographer and I'm a good model, and you're doing one, you know, one layout, mm -hmm. there's no reason you need more than at the most 200 pictures right. but even then that's that's, that's like double what you really really need because <laughs> if you're doing it right you, you know i say three hours in and out like right. that should be how long it takes if you have hair and makeup okay five hours because right. two hours for that but geez you know i'm almost always shoot anal mm -hmm. and i don't eat before a scene i stop eating the night before usually and that means that I'm hungry. Right. <laughs> and I don't eat gummy bears, like that's the anal food. <laughs> that's, someone else told me that. And I don't eat gummy bears, because right. they're toxic, so <laughs> I don't eat them. So yeah, you know, uh, I'm hungry, let's get the show on the road. And I don't know, it just doesn't seem like that can be done. Uh, let's get the show on the road, but I have one more question for you. Yeah. New girls coming in, do they ever say, look, Ryan Connor, you've been around for a while? I need yes. some advice. Yes, all the time. Uh, both in private stuff. Uh -huh. um, you know, how do you handle your boyfriend? How do you tell somebody? Um, how did you do anal? How, like, how do you make it work for the movies? Because I'm on set all day. Uh -huh. How can you not, you know, like all the prep work that goes into doing anal. Some right. people are different. Some people use Imodium and different stuff. I don't do that. So uh -huh. there's an art of knowing your body, you know? <laughs> ready to do this? Her dog fart? I am ready Let's get to it get going. double stuff <laughs> for dog fart. <laughs>